three more victims of a bathroom video voyeur just identified and police believe there could be more. A Riviera Beach man, in fact, found with more than a million images on his phone is now facing charges tonight. The case started with a camera inside a bathroom at St. Mary's Medical Center, and that is not the only location. But when I get to contact five investigator Maris Badcock, she's live outside another medical facility affected in Boca Raton. Maris. A spokesperson for the Boca Raton Police Department confirms that they believe a hidden camera was placed inside a bathroom here at Lynn Cancer Institute off Northwest 13th Street in Boca Raton and the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office. They're investigating a third hidden camera incident all tied to the same suspect. Arrested in Houston, trying to board a flight to Guatemala, investigators believe Rudamiro Santizo Perez may have planted hidden cameras inside bathrooms at three medical facilities across Palm Beach County. An employee first reported a hidden camera at St. Mary's Medical Center. When investigators caught up with Perez, they say they found a million images and videos on his phone. I just feel bad as far as the victims and even regular people now watching this. I have to be careful of going to the bathroom. You, it's a vulnerable thing and now we're all just going to be looking in every crease and crevice for a camera. They've identified three victims captured on a hidden camera inside a bathroom at the Lynn Cancer Institute off Northwest 13th Street. And investigators with the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office say they found a camera at a second Lynn Cancer Institute in suburban Delray Beach. So far, no known victims in that case. He is the only employee that works at all three of those facilities uh, at the time that those cameras were, that one camera was placed there. Um, he is the only employee with access to any of those bathrooms, one of them being locked for only employee use. Now, investigators don't believe any of those victims are underage, but they're still trying to identify as many people as possible. And they believe the camera here at this Boca facility was placed on September 30th. Reporting live from the Lynn Cancer Institute in Boca, I'm Maris Badcock, WPTV News Channel 5.